Hey guys, it's Holly. I'm going to show you how to use your Samantha font with extra glyphs and Cricut Design Space for iPhone and iPad. I'll start by going to my character map. It's the Unicode Character Viewer in the App Store and I'll link that below. I'll tap the first option Browse Fonts and then I'll go down to the Samantha Upright. As soon as we tap the font, you can see that we're already able to access all the extra glyphs and characters. So this is alphabetical order. I'll just scroll down to the letter that I'm looking for. It starts with the capitals and it goes down to the lowercase. So I'll start with my lowercase c here. When I get my letter, I'll choose the export button in the top right. And then when my options come up, I'll tap copy. Okay, now let me take it back into the design space. Okay, so I'm going to create a new text box. There is a glitch with the Samantha glyphs on here. So, keep you two fonts pulled up. Start with another font, not Samantha. And then we're going to go to edit and change it back to Samantha after we have pasted it in our text box. After we change it to Samantha, it'll change it to the glyph that we want to use. So, back to our Unicode map, and I'll pick the G that I want. Same process here. Tap the character, then tap the upper right export, and copy. Back to Design Space. New text box with a different font, then tap edit and change it to Samantha Upright. Okay, so I'm ready to create the middle of my font. I'm just gonna create a new text box and enter that text here. Remember with script fonts, you have to change your letter spacing. So make it a little bit bigger so I can see, go to edit, and then I'm going to decrease my letter space. And now to create my final word, I'm going to select all of my letters and I'm going to go to actions and weld my word. And from here, I'll just use a new text box to create the rest of my design. And because I'm using a bolder font, I have to go ahead and increase my letter space again, center that how I want it, and now I have my design. So give the video a like, subscribe to my channel, and until next time, thank you.